welcome to a new video king kobe here now in this episode we are going to continue our keyboard mapping series right in the previous episode we looked at how to set your keys for switching the decks and also we looked at how to load and then unload song using the l and then u key right if you missed that episode kindly go back to go and watch the video on my channel now before we get into the business of the day if you are a returning viewer and then you have not subscribed to my youtube channel i appreciate the fact that you are watching my videos but you subscribing to my channel will go a long way to help me if you are a subscriber and then you are watching this video thank you for your support you might also want to go ahead and then give me some super thanks if my videos are insightful to you if you are new on this channel i will also kindly urge you to subscribe to my youtube channel and then turn on notifications and then i promise you that you are not going to regret subscribing to my youtube channel now the business of the day today we are going to look at how to set keys for the queue this one the play pause and stop we just have to head to my um, settings and then mappings right you know that the previous version of virtual dj had the play pause at either space or p right so i've also done mine like that so you just set play pause for p and then play pause for spacebar as well and then i also set s for stop and then c for q so the q works depending on your your q settings so either you have it at q cup or you have it at just q right that's that depends on you as to what you want so let me take my time again so for q your key is c and then the action is what q c u e right for stop is s and then the action is stop the spelling stop and play pause we have space bar for the key and then the action is what play underscore pause the same for p right you might as well go ahead and then change for s instead of just stop i can say cause stop right and then i'll save it now this is what a post stop does so if i have this song loaded right let me lower the gain so that it will not disrupt and it's playing when i hit s for the first time it will pause the song but when i hit it again it goes back to the beginning of the song so that's what the pause stop does now let's test out all our keys that we used when you even look at the tool tip here you will see what this one does so the cue is also we have cue and then stop right so let's go to the mappings and then we'll do q underscore stop so that we'll have the same thing so it means that if i am playing and then i press c it stops the song right it stopped the song to the last q point that i started from so let's say i set a hot q here q1 let me bring it somewhere here and then i set q2 right so i am currently in q2 right so when i play and i press c it stops at q2 right it will stop at q2 because that was the last q that i started the song from it will not go back to the beginning so pressing the s will now bring me to the beginning of the song itself where the song actually starts right not the q point itself and when i continue to press the s key it now circles through the various q points that i have set on that particular song so p play pause spacebar play pause s stop c is a q stop so when the song is stopped 
now the C will act as Q, right? But if it is playing and then I press it, it will now stop two and then go back to the last Q that I set. So that will be it for this episode. If this video was insightful to you, kindly like and share and please subscribe to my youtube channel and don't forget to turn on your notifications so that you'll be notified anytime i upload a new video the name is talking kobe until i come your way with another video stay safe and make music magic